Right then, I've just got back from my bike ride that I said I was going to have at the end of last episode and it was phenomenal. Lads, it's so sunny outside today and I've been out on my steel horse, my bike, and wow. Do you know when you can smell yourself, like, not like body odour, like skin's been in the sun, when you can smell your skin burning? <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. Right, anyways, what's better is The Witcher 3. Let's help, go. Help us! Someone, help us! What's this about? Monsters! Monsters there, in the cave! We managed to flee, but Hugo remains inside! Hugo? Our brother! He's still in there, inside! Help us find him! We'll pay you for your toil! I'll find little Hugo. Why do you even go in there? We lost our way. Bullshit. Mm, mistake that cave for the high road. By the hair on my chinny chin chin, what difference does it make whether we went in for a stroll or together gather students? Hugo remains inside, in grave danger. That's what matters. Will you go in after him or not? Every second could be vital. Money first. I could look into it. But it'll cost you. How much would you take? Three sixty, and that's because I like you. A reasonable price. Oh, there we go then. You post that notice about an escort? Yes, we did. And not without cause, it seems. We waited some days. Yet when none answered, we risked the expedition unaccompanied. Fools we were. We'd have done better to show patience. Wait. Poor Hugo. Left to an unknown fate. Right, I'll go and get him. Fine. I'll look for him. You two stay out here. You go, are you there? Damn it. Light it up. Oh, there's the big one. Shit the bed. Can't see shit, son. He's a big boy, isn't he? Ooh. Right, this guy's gonna get set on fire, watch this. Ooh, that's got an area of effect, that's why he keeps hitting us. Yeah, warriors are beasts, aren't they? Any good loot? I'll see something through here. Hello? Oh wait, we're supposed to be searching for him in there, but... Oh, those are spiders. No, they're not. Get wrecked. I love the runes on the, these swords, they look amazing. They like glow in combat. Oh look! The very first one we've ever Place found in the power. DLC. Should draw from it. Actually, speaking of that, do you know what I forgot about? I don't think we've actually got any. But um red mutagens. Have we found any since? No, we haven't. You can craft lesser red mutagens. 
Oh, shit. We did not know this. Oh, that's right. Because we found the the book, didn't we? That allows us to transmute. Oh, fucking hello. A winter cherry. No idea where to get one of them from, though. We do have that, though. Can we craft a greater? No, we're one short. Okay. Yeah, we need one more and then we can get Bloodbath. Every time you attack something, it increases power by 5%. Phenomenal. But it, it, you lose it if you take damage. That, that's still going to be really good. Oh, hello. Martina Kriska. Dear Martina Kriska, congratulations on being promoted to the Imperial Academy at Castel Gorpon. I'm sure you'll quickly become one of the institution's premier scholars. Yet before you set off for Nilfgaard, I order Victor, I old Victor Monot would ask you to do for a small favour. You know my sons, you play together as children, so you know how hard it is to coax them to get along. I feel in my bones it will soon come at a time for me to leave the Vale of Tears. Yet, I shall go with a heavy heart known Auguste, Hugo and Lucien. We'll go at each other's throats as soon as I pass. Thus I have dismantled my famed still into three parts and ask you my darling Martina to hide them from my sons. Perhaps searching together for the missing pieces of a machine, which will give them wealth, will bind them together and forever put an end to these foolish quarrels. In exchange for your trouble, I have included a modest pouch of, pouch of coin. So wait there. I've dismantled my famed still into three parts so they're alchemists. So that's why she's done that. Try and bring them together and it seems to have worked. Ah, there we go. Now we've got the blue to green. Nice. Not that we ever need green ones. Warm and damp. Kiki Moors prefer cooler environments. Probably why they keep their distance. Blood trail. Could be Hugo's wounded. Damn, water's hot. Get burned if I don't watch it. Could use some protection. Maybe Quen will work. But do you want me to go in the water, like? Oh shit, there's stuff in the water. Still filter. Got it already. Out of curiosity, can we stand here? No, it doesn't work. Oh, he's alive! You, Hugo. Your brother sent me. Ja! Desserts! Scoundrels! Heartmongers! They attacked me, but I fented them off. Now, they sent a brigand to finish the job. Motherfuckers. What are you talking about? Ran into them outside, claimed monsters attacked. They ran, made it out, but you got stuck inside. They asked me to help you. Is that what they told you? The lying weasels. More trickery on their part, I'm certain. Whoa, slow down. What's this about? Uh, I'm Hugo Monar. My father, Victor Monar, you may have heard of. A cognac distiller he was, famed for it. Before he passed, my brothers and I would quarrel over who would inherit the family business. So father decided he would force us to work together. He broke his still down into its parts. Three of them he hid, telling each of us the location of one. When my brothers learned my part, the last, was hidden in here, they decided they did not need me anymore. They decided to cut me out of the business, literally. 
We argued, fought. The noise must have woken the beasts. My brothers ran for the mouth, while I ran deeper in. Hmm. Is that true, though? I have found the missing part. Hmm. So you came here to find a piece of a still? Mean this thing? Yes! Where did you find it? Bottom of the pool of a hot spring. Really hit it well, your father. Your pay. It is not much, I know. But I promise you good prices. The best once the tavern is open again. Hold you to that. Now let's go. Brothers are probably getting antsy. Ah, he's gonna go back to his brothers. Really? Wait, see there. My brothers. Oh. They've rounded up some thugs. They mean to attack me. They actually have. We don't know that. Would you try to tell me it's a coincidence that they return with an armed band? They've come for the last part of the still. They won't kill me for it. Please, you my only hope. Kill them. Elsewise, they'll kill me. Kill your no. brothers? You want that? Well, perhaps not them, but the other roughs for certain. As to my brothers, I don't know. You couldn't perhaps render them harmless? Ah, uh, will you defend me? I'll see. No one dies. Not about to start cutting folk down because of a family squabble about some spare bit of machinery. We're going over there, and you're gonna settle this, talk it out. But should they attack, you will protect me, will you not? If they attack, unprovoked. Let's go. Yeah, he could just want the two Hugo, brothers dead. Are you well? We were worried. Why do I doubt this? Listen, while you were in there, we realized this Tiff is senseless, idiotic. You might have been harmed gravely, and that's something we could never live down. Lucian is right. We must bury this hatchet, work together as father wished it. Hmm. Claim to come in peace. But then who are these men? Hunters, who had made camp nearby. They spotted us and asked if we had no need for their aid. You went in, were gone a long time. With these men to help, we thought we might come to your rescue. All right, glad to see you've made up. Now I really need to get back to my own affairs. Naturally. Your payment. We thank you for your help. Should you ever find yourself near the clever clogs, you must stop in. Superb, Cognac. Some of the best. Will do. So long. Hmm. Okay, well that was uh, a bit weird. But every, everybody suck cocks and made up, did they? Fair enough. Father did know best in fact, didn't he? Right then, what's next? Wine Wars. I wonder what these are. Big feet to fill. There's the Kickamore nest. Night for hire. Okay, what we'll do is we'll do this Wine Wars. This sounds like it's going to be pretty funny. And then we'll do these ones without a quest, like a level number. Okay. quite far from everything so let's hit this up see if we can get a fast travel there's bound to be one in one of these little settlements yeah a nice little house oh I hear giants Cyclops. Get wrecked. 
That was easy. I've noticed when you rescue settlements in the Blood and Wine, there's actually like no. Sometimes there's merchants that appear. Doesn't happen in this. Not that there's anything left to buy, to be fair. Right, so we'll hit these two up and then we'll go over to Palace Gardens. And then we fully explored this side of the map. Well, apart from them up there, but that's a different Run, story. Rage. Rio can outpost. Oh, it's a monster nest. What of? Harpies, it's been a while since we. No. Get off the horse. Bro, he will not get off the fucking horse. See so, ya. Yeah. Where's your mate? Been a Rooney. Wait, how do we get it? Wait, this is a chest. It has no loot. Ah, it's a puzzle. Harpies got their nest here. Samuel aids notes. All has hounded me to do some chores again. But at first I shall sum up the beginning of my tale for the benefit of any who happen upon it. My dearest love, I don't care. Art on the roof, man. This is the monster nest. Light it up. Next. Oh, we've got a fast travel point there as well. Perfect. So when we view this, oh shit, I've nearly felt me death. When we get to this next place, we can quickly run back here and teleport. Great. Give me a bit of Quen. Vintar's contract. Witcher. Wine merchant. You, sir, are a witcher. The very one the Duquesa summoned. Guilty as charged. And you gotta be someone who wants something from me. It's like you read my mind. You see, those caves are like cellars the gods carved out for their own stores. Spacious, dry. Just some monster lives inside them. A soothsayer. Gods be Celted, a soothsayer. So, will you help? This is just like the other quest, isn't it? We've got to kill the spiders. I'll take care Might of it. Might help. Might not. not. Depends on whether we can agree on a fee. I think. 238 is a good price. Well, <sighs> nearly there. Alright then. 235. Well, nearly. Bro, don't be a dick. Well,. Well, how, how nearly is nearly? You need to give me some sort of frame of reference? Good. Yes, so be it. Sure, I'll see to it. For the sizable reward I foresee you giving me. Ah, so it is a different quest. Right, well, that's fine. 
Let's go. A job is like a latest wine wars. Do you think this quest is actually part of wine wars? I mean, it seems like it seems like it would be. It's all involved in wine. Auction. A job is like a lady. You can always get a new one. <laughs> a job is like a lady. You can always get a new one. Never have I heard a truer word spoken. For four generations, that is how long my family has been producing wine. Producing Plonk unfit to drink, you mean? Which is exactly why you should sell Belgat to me, not him. As a ducal clerk, I must look after the duchy's best interests. Belgard currently belongs to the treasury. The minister of the treasury has clearly expressed his desire that Belgard be handed over to a responsible steward. Yet, diverse troubles beset both your present holdings. Until you resolve them and thus prove yourselves competent, selling Belgard to either of you is out of the question. Well, Happy, this is your fault! Mine? You're deranged, woman! Hark! Good folk! Be it known, Matilda de Vermentino is a cursed, spiteful lunatic! Doesn't look cursed to me, just really, really angry. Ticked her off quite a bit, you have. Truly? How would you know? A shrew tamer, are you? <laughs> Better. A connoisseur. <laughs> I see we speak the same tongue. So tell me, the swords, you merely wear them to intimidate? Or do you actually use them? Tools of my trade. I'm a witcher. Not seeking work, are you? Y you see, I wish to buy a vineyard. Belgard. Yet that bloody bureaucrat's not likely to sell it to me until I settle my troubles at home, at Coronata. What kind of troubles are we talking about? Ah, uh, it's botched in more ways than one. The herbarium, infested with monsters. My steward gone missing with an entire transport of wine. Uh, and someone's abducted my herbalist. You're up shit uh, creek. Bad luck for one little vineyard. If you ask me, it's that Matilda, her handiwork. A sugar sweet face, a temper sharp as horseradish. S so will you help? Yeah, don't work for free. And I'll have to speak to Matilda first. Good look into it, but not for free. That goes without saying. What is your rate? Oh, this is a good rate. Expensive. About 800. We'll go 830 because I'm feeling generous. That sounds fair. Sure sounds like work for a witcher. Yeah, I'll help. I am really, truly grateful. Thank you. My vineyard lies east of here. You're sure to find it. Now forgive me. I must talk to that quill pusher. I might win him over yet. We've just been from there, haven't we? Oh no, 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 no. We we came from west. Ah, oh, setting up secret meetings. Yeah, baby. All she needs to do is spread her legs, and I'm I'm in there. You're a witcher, yes? I heard you talking to that oafish ogre Liam. Disgusting man. The worst sort. First, seduces with a dashing gaze, the fair face, then reveals a cold black heart. But that's all beside the point. I stopped you because I want to buy Belgat too. Alas. Things are rotten at my own vineyard, Vermentino. Hmm. Strange coincidence. No coincidence. I am certain Liam's thrown a stick in my spokes. Several sticks. My cooper and blacksmith both have mysteriously vanished. Man-eating plants have sprouted on my paths, and strange things are afoot on Pheasant Hill. Ah, the list goes on, but the crux is one. 
I must solve my problems at Vermentino if I'm to stand any chance of acquiring Belgard. Would you help me before you help Leon? I'm willing to pay more than he's offered you. Yeah, how much? It's gonna have to be more than 830, it's gonna have to be about 950. Which I think it's out of your price range, pet. I'm an expensive man. Best I can do. I sense we're close. <sighs> Very close. Okay. okay, okay, okay. 930, 100 more than him. I sense we're close. Very close. Unfortunately, not close enough. I'm gonna be helping Liam. I sense we're close. What's you fucking getting annoyed for, the silly cow? I sense we're close. Listen, my fucking. Listen. 900, nothing. I sense we're She's a fucking moron. Fine. Settled. I can help. Please try. Wonderful. You've no idea how much that means to me. My vineyard lies due west. So that's where we came from. I shall stay here for a time. I must make certain Liam does not pull some stunt while my back is turned. Gotcha. Farewell. Thing is, we don't know if any of their allegations are true. Wine Wars. Was the were the other ones part of Wine Wars? Oh, Coranta. No, they're different. Oh, that's the. Oh, okay. It turned the quest off. Right, we'll go to him and we'll, we'll try and help her to try and get some poon. Um, see, we've never been there actually. Oh, these are all the different problems she's got. Right, we'll head north and then we'll go anti-clockwise around. Roach, got a tiff on her hands. Go, go. A lover's tiff. I wonder if we can just solve them both. And then have them like joint venture. How do I get down? this just wonderful Wolves. I look around oh big feet to fill new quest we're not doing that now Why did it change my quest? Right, what's going on here? Oh! Watch out, he's gonna kill his friend! Light it up! Was more. That was easy enough. There is a hidden treasure here. Oh, there it is. Augustine Tunnel's journal. Key to a chest in the sunflower fields. Mysterious gentleman has come to me asking whether I would agree to sell him the stock of barrels we are preparing for the new wine variety. 
I refused him curtly for I know how much the wine means to Miss Matilda and how much depends on this wine's success. After all, things have been very tight at the vineyard these days. This extremely mysterious gentleman has turned out to be equally extremely wealthy. He came to me again with a very hefty pouch. Bum blast it. It will be very hard to refuse him if he puts me on that trial again. Today I forgot to lock the gates to the barrel storehouse. I'm very ashamed, but what can I do? Miss Matilda is crushed. I won't touch that coin until all has settled down. I've hidden a sack stuffed with North Guardian Florins in the sunflower fields. I would not want someone to find such a fortune in my home. He's paid me another visit. This time he wanted me to procure him the recipe for the new wine. I do have some honour. Barrels are one thing. I can make new ones, perhaps even better ones, but the recipe for the wine, I said I'd sooner die. And then he gave me this strange look, sent shivers down my spine. I think I best barricade the doors this night. It's none of them, is it? Don't take candy from a stranger. So that's the chest, which I'm not doing. Yeah, okay. So this stranger is the one that's probably done both of their fields, honey. Oh, those ones with the Vinter's contract. That's a separate... Wine Wars. Yeah, a lot, lot to do with wine here. Okay, where's the next one? Closest. Oh, you can't cycle through them. Well, we'll write her there. Yeah, I don't think it's either of them. They're probably both innocent and it's this mysterious fellow. I guess we'll find out. We should lure him in. We should get the, the recipe, the con, the, yeah, the recipe. And then lure this mysterious fellow in and murder him horrifically. Slow now, whoa. Oh, bandits. Yes, I am. We're going to get a spinner rooney on the go. Oh, spinner rooney. Get wrecked. Hello, fellas. You like fire? Beautiful. There's more. I'll take him from the Celebrations! Like an infant, it must be born. Where, 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 well, we were headed this way, weren't we? Roach, what are you doing in the river? Oh. Actually, ah. now it's probably easier to run because the areas are quite narrow and the horse always stops. I'd have him in the field if he would hurry up. Don't, don't climb the tree, please. No, please. I knew this was a bad idea. Person's in distress. Oh, so someone's alive. Today, baby. All right, mate. Uh, 
Who are you? I owe you my life, unknown knight. How are you dubbed? Dubbed Geralt. Geralt of Rivia. My thanks, Sir Geralt. The Scallywag sought to demolish our herb garden, you see. I thought I shall take a hum, scare the rubble off, but to my great chagrin, there were too many and I, I failed. Ah, there's no use crying over spilt wine. Come with me to Vormentino. I'll patch up your armor or pound the anvil to fulfill some other need you might have. It's blacksmith. Go ahead. I'll stop by when I'm in the area. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not getting pulled away from this quest. We'll see him later. Not that he's going to be. He's only an armorer. Got my best armor already. Let's stop off here. Jump. Yes, he made it. Ooh, hello. Rabid rock troll. You just headbutt us? Oh. I can't get him. Sorry, bro. Feels bad, but. Rag scrap with writing on it. R written in blood. On this scrap, rent. By my own garment, using my own blood as a fragment of bone and some unknown creature, I write a summary of my sad tale. I spied a monster roaming approximately to my estate. It was a she troll, descended from the Golden Foothills. I scraped together a few crowns and went to the Camalengo to request he hire a knight errant to slay the monstrosity. And it obviously went up bad. That was a sad tale. Hey, 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 horse! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Chill, Winston. Right, we'll quickly hit this up. Bandits. We like bandits. Do big damage actually. What the cattle tickets? Watch out. Oh my god, double kill. That was phenomenal. Double parry. Get wrecked. Orders on bloody paper. Carlo, send you another batch of hay seeds with big dreams of banditry. Train them well as only you can and send me the tough ones. Down the, drown the other ones in the pond. I was trying to see if there was any dead bodies in there. Codex of Halfbreed's Hunts. We chain dogs in russet rags. Ah, blue to red. Come on, Roach. We've nearly solved this. Well, I think we have. We need info on this mysterious man. Oh, fuck me, I hate these. 
Lads, these creatures are awful. Roach, you know, fuck my shit right up. Fucking hell, these guys are beasts. Yeah, Ark spores are absolutely awful. Nicely done. Yeah, like I said before, those were really difficult in Witcher 1 as well. Probably the hardest like regular creatures in the game. Last one on us, two. Still two more. Which one's closest? How is there two more? Huh? Oh, there's one there. Okay, so what we'll do is. We need to get that Chichote cave. Which is pretty much straight ahead. Actually it doesn't matter. We'll just ride there. <clears throat> Come on, Roach, don't be a bitch. Roach, run. You've been told. You motherfucker. Come on, jump. Take it easy. Oh, don't jump down there. Ah, oh, fuck this. Mm -hmm. Oh, more. So dull, then, you idiot. Bro, why is he trying to fist fight it? Fuck. That was it, just the last one. Oh, that's why it didn't tick up because these two vineyards must have um, been like the same objective for killing the ox spores. Good 
We've only got one more problem left. Oh, we'll just ride there. What's happening? What? You're scared of a horse? Roche is scared of you. I just need to pour without taking scared of your insolence. Does the horse ever do what it asks you ask it to do? Oh, what a view. River. Windmills. This looks nice. Oh, it's the caterpillars! The centipedes, I mean. Didn't we have to kill these for something? Oh, it was for the eggs for the mutagens. Right, these guys are fuckers. Got it. Got him. Show me what you got. Oh, it's on its armor. Shit. I forgot the armor on the arse end. Got it. Awesome. There's another Giant one though. Centipede spawning ground. Should destroy it. Yeah, fuck these centipedes like. This is an enemy here, but there's nothing. Good. <laughs> Good. We, uh, I. What? All right, man. We, uh, I. That's pretty cool. You want to say thanks? Go, go. Good lad. Sands Retour Valley. You have the horse. Why is this thing invincible? What the fuck? Light it up. Mm, looks 
Looks like an orca spore killed him. Oh, yeah, a bad day. Him, he's got no head or legs. Heavy brass key. Elegant station. Read these orders carefully, if I will not tolerate any blunders. Report to the agreed upon location tomorrow and collect the next delivery of seedlings. We must intensify, intensify our efforts to infest Vermentino. Be at pains to arrive on time for the team from the other vineyard will be waiting. Motherfuckers. Apparently someone's sabotaging operations at Vermentino, but the letter doesn't say who. Hmm. Need to keep looking. Nah, still find we're out. Yeah, we're going to investigate the whole thing. I'm going to blow the doors wide motherfucking open. Yeah, because it's not this guy's fault, is it? Like, they were blaming each other, but it's neither. Let's get to the Sun Tour Valley. Where's first on the hit list? Right, we'll start at the trading post and we'll work our way around that way. Actually, no, we'll go there first. We technically shouldn't be riding through here because there's that day. Uh, what was it? Not a cockatrice. Some sort of flying creature. I forgot what it was actually. The white, the white thing. Orc tail, maybe? I don't know. We did the quest last episode. Have you seen that? There's a little hole in the mountain. Like a cave. Rock trolls. Two of them, shit. He hit his friend in the head with a rock. Sorry bro, but you gotta go down to Chinatown. Cosmo Cyril. Enough of this hesitation is threatened, these feelings of guilt. Liam Coronata pays you practically nothing and you've got a family to feed. So do as I say, load up a cart with barrels of that new spice wine and in the night, quiet as a mouse, haul it away from the estate. Hmm. You've got a family to feed, so do as I say. Yeah. Head northwest, and when you cross the stream, you'll find men waiting for you. Give them the barrels. They must be desperate to get this wine. Because me merely as down payment, they've handed me a pleasantly heavy pouch. Just be careful, because a pair of those vile rock trolls hunt the Bleasure Valley. Hide the share of down payment I've sent. Per a pile of dung. That's another treasure hunt, which I'm not interested in. Right, Roach. Yeah! All these fuckers. Oh, 
Oh fuck. Motherfuckers. Hey, hold on, let's just chill out a second. Show me what These, these guys are fucking dickheads like Hit us with it then. Is that it? Where's your friend? I must have killed it. Yeah, they are awful then. Blue itself didn't kill him. Led to death afterwards. Orders mm, on elegant stationery. No chance this letter wound up here by accident. Feel me this time and I'll skin that sposhly hide off your rump. Pick up the next batch of seedlings tomorrow from the Teshem Munta Hatchery. We need to infect another spot of Koran data. But don't be late because the team in front of the vineyard on the other side of the river has got the key. Interesting. This node plus what I found earlier. Some third party's causing problems at the vineyards. Need to find the spot the letter mentions. Yeah, we do. However... Find something mighty interesting behind whatever door this key opens. We'll clear up his wine place first. Come here! Hey, 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 hey! Bandits, please. Yes! Did someone to summon help? Faster! Faster! Blood is still here! Come on, baby, hit us. Come on, come closer. Oh, who's the daddy? Wanna fucking play? Come on then, play. Say ya. Uh, nice little spinner only there with your head. Finished report. Around the world, it is. We're getting lots of um, treasure hunts. Like ones that don't necessarily just. It's always like an additional. Like you find a, find a letter, then go to another place. Oh, fuck me, Molly.
Bro, what you got your fist out for? Bruh! Bruh! Fuck this shit! Get your weapon out, man. Geralt sometimes a fucking absolute plebeian sometimes, isn't he? Was it just the one? You hear that? Tiny with honey. I don't know why. You hear that high pitched noise? Weird. That's it's birds. Some sort of. So yeah, it's a weird noise. Last one, then we'll go and confront the people who've been fucking with these vineyards. No passage, no passage. Who said that like? <laughs> no passage, why? Oh, they think they're happy watching me fight these things. This one's really hard actually. Done. Yeah, it is. There we go. Right. Now, find the place mentioned in the letter. It's very far away. So we need a fast travel point. And there's one over here. But first off, why is there no passage? Mate, I go where I choose. Halt! No passage! No passage! Cut Remember, the, the Camelango pays out a handsome reward for a each hand you dispatch. No passage down this way. It's a hunting ground for the beast Count de Selfiris protects. I'm already on the other side, mate. What's what's the uh, what's the deal, yo? Look, I'm oh, I'm already on the other side. I vow to fight the Hanses to the death. <laughs> There's more words to point to that. Hey, right, so let's get a fast travel. Yeah. For the rescue, you come on, grand fine fellow, with your. That I am, the finest of fellows. Some 
My hands shake so bad. I cannot. Shit, they're very far away. We've never been this far before. My tools. One, two. Roach. Stop fucking around. Oh, oh there. Hmm. Myself, I like Count Monier's idea. Fool. Good news. Oh, is it going to be up there? Oh, what's this? A bear. No, it's not in the tower. Oh, the tower does look interesting. Here we go, baby. I can see there's a door below us. The dace in the machina. Nobody. Oh. Motherfucker. Light it up. This is where they bred the spores, isn't it? Site of stock taken. Vespine Arshbow Hatchery, codename Mushroom Farm near Tesha Mutna. Owner Commissioner of Stock Taken, Count Vladimir Crespi. Stock under review, Vespine Arshbow Bulbs. Six dormen, 24 buds without sprouts. Changes since last stock taken, 12 bulbs, 6B transported to Corona. Count Crespi's orders, 6B transported. Vermintendo on Count Crespi's orders. Some bulbs are now too mature to be safely transported. They should be burned, otherwise they'll sprout hatchery. It proves Count Crespi's behind the sabotage of the saplings. Gotta tell me until generally to cultivate something like this. Need to incinerate them before they spew spores and spread. Light them up. Done. Yeah, there was one thing that you get if you pay Geralt your money, is you get a comprehensive job, didn't you? So we don't get a... Mate, I want to kill this Count... Count... What was he called? On plebeian or something. No fast travel. There's no fast travel. There's definitely be a fast travel here. Where are the fast travel point? Oh, is this the castle that we were looking at? It is. Probably Witcher gear here. I would imagine. Something wicked here. It's in the air. I can smell it. Is there a fast travel point? A banshee? Light it up! Light it up! Light it up! Light it up! Fucking hell, she did big damage there. 
They are quite hard. Probably died in the well. Ah, we found the fast travel, but we'll come back there later. There's gonna there, there is a cave there, but this is what I wanted. What I wanted. Let's see how this plays out. Madame, Monsieur, we shall Ooh. never get anywhere in the Master Witcher, have you any news? One and the same man caused Coronada's and Vermentino's problems. Got proof. A certain Count Crespi. Count He's Crespi. Of it all. What, Crespi? Belgard's erstwhile owner? Why, that's impossible. Got it all here, in writing. He did, indeed, have motive. He knew well his own vineyard could not survive if Vermentino and Coronata were to join forces. Probably why he incited the feud. Pulled it off, too, mostly. Just failed to bring his plan to completion when the beast got him. Incredible. You mean to say it... it wasn't Liam? And I was certain my troubles were Matilda's doing. <clears throat> In light of new evidence, uh... The most just resolution would be for both injured parties to share oversight of Belgard. Good idea. Wait, just a minute. Do you mean to suggest we're to cooperate? It's the optimal solution, yes. In terms of the health of the Enterprise as well. Hmm. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I do believe he's right. Perhaps it is time to bury the hatchet. Three Consummate this are victory. More than one. There's much to be gained. So be it. That's not all. The troubles at your vineyards? Solve them. You can go back to operating normally now. Splendid news. I'm relieved to see you hired a professional, especially one whose aid might still prove invaluable. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Follow me. It's high time you saw Belgard. Witcher, come with us, please. Something tells me we'll have tasks for you yet. Nice. I'll join you later. Join you later. Need to tend to something else first. Yeah, I'll tell you what we'll do. Oh my god. That's awesome. It took it's gonna lead us into a new set of quests. Hopefully it gets us to take down the other the other vineyard, Mr. Crispy. Right lads, we'll call an episode there. Save it. Boom. When we come back, we're gonna continue with the Wine Wars quest. I didn't realise it was this long, but it's awesome. See you there, lads.